Hi everyone, thank you for joining me. I have another fun uh, project share uh, that I'd like to show you guys and I will also uh, show you how you could make one of these as well. Uh, so it's a cute little envelope with a pocket style flip book and this project is also um, a great for a mini a photo album you can add some photos in here it's also a great project uh, for you to use in your travelers mini notebook as an insert so this is the flip book it's really really cute um, it measures three inches by four inches I've used uh, some crocheted uh, string to use as a closure for the book and then I just added some of these little heart shapes using my heart shape paper punch. So I just punched out um, two of these and then I just glued them back to back and then I just adhered it to the end of the string and then the same for the other side. And I just think that just gives it a really fun decorative look to your flip book. And then I've just got some tags here as well. So um, there, I mean, you can use any kind of closure if you wanted to. You can use a paper clip, a wooden clothespin, you can make your own belly band to make it as a closure or you don't have to if you don't want to. So I'm just going to show the inside and then um, I'll go ahead and show you how you could make one as well. It's a very simple project as well. Um, it's a great little um, project if you wanted to make something really quick and I'll just, um, just undo that and so this is how it looks like. So when you open it up you get the envelope on this side here and what I've got in there are just some um, three by four journaling cards or um, project life cards so they'll fit nicely in the envelope you could also add a gift card in here uh, some craft goodies a letter whatever you like on this side and then on the next page is your top pocket and I've got in here some washi sample and then just a pack of um, stickers on the back there and then when you turn that over I've just kept these two pages blank and embellished that side and on this side here I just um, cut this out from one of my paper pads and it's just a, a little spot to write a note um, you can also use this page as um, another place where you can add goodies by adding some pockets in here if you wanted to some more envelopes onto um, these pages you could also add another page with a little flap where you can open and close out as well so this is just another place for you where you can have some fun with that part and then that's how it looks like it's still nice and flat and again it's a great place for you to add some photos in here if you wanted to or use this as a card to give to somebody or again as an insert in your mini travelers notebook so I'm going to show you how to make one of those so what you need is you'll need an envelope and you want your envelope to measure about oh, an envelope that will fit a three by four and I use my we are memory keepers envelope punch board to make the envelope um, and it's for the card size it's a three by four and the paper that you need to cut the envelope is a six by six paper so if you've got some six by six paper pad um, you can make a three by four envelope and then what you also need is you need to cut a another piece of paper at four and a quarter inches by nine and a quarter of an inch and then you're going to score on the nine and a quarter inch side you're going to score it at three inches and six and one eighth of an inch and what we're going to do now we'll just assemble it and if you're using double-sided paper the part that you want um, to show as the flip part you want that um, you want that side facing up and then we're going to fold the left side back that's on the three inch side and then make sure you press your fold line nice and well and then the panel on the right side we're going to fold that towards you and again folding your fold line nice and flat and then what we're going to do next is you're going to grab the envelope and the opening flap of the envelope you're going to apply glue to that flap so we're just going to apply glue or you can use your double sided um, tape if you wanted to and on your left panel on the edge of that paper we're going to slide that oh, and, and glue that just 
below the fold line of your envelope. That way your um, envelope can open and close um, easily. So just below the fold line and then adhere that like that. And then when you've got that, uh, this part here, if, um, if you wanted to have a notch for your pocket, go ahead and punch um, your notch here using your circle punch first. If you don't want to do that, you don't have to. And then what we're going to do is we're just going to turn that over and then on your middle panel here, we're going to apply glue to the inside of that fold line. Or again, whatever adhesive you want to use. And also just to the bottom, just up to that fold line. And then we're just going to bring this back and press that together. And that will create your top pocket up here. And then that part is your back part. And then that's how you close it. Now, my paper didn't line up properly, so I'm, we'll just cut that off later on. But I just wanted to show you how you could um, create one of these little envelope with a top pocket uh, flip book. So that's how you open it up. And then there's your top pocket up here. And then you turn that over and that's your double page. So just another quick and easy project for you if you want to make one of these cute little envelope with a top pocket flip book. Um, if you do decide to have a go at making one of these and you are a follower of mine on Instagram, please um, let me have a look at what you made. I'd love to see what you've created as well. And then just hashtag um, septeria 18 or you can tag me so I could also have a look at what you made. Um, thank you for watching this video and I will see you soon. Bye bye.